For medium and wide shots, it's not always possible to position the boom microphone close to the actor. Alternatively, the boom mic could be edited out of the shot during post-production. First, import both videos into your After Effects project. The first video should be the take with the actor and the boom microphone in the shot. And the second video should be the take without the boom mic in the shot. Next, use the pen tool to draw the mask around the boom microphone for the take with your actor in the shot. If the video with the boom microphone and actor isn't already above the layer with the boom mic in the shot, then move it to the layer above. Now, edit the settings of the mask of the video with the actor and the boom mic in the shot. First, change the mode setting from normal to subtract. This will remove the section where you drew your mask around the boom microphone. The video layer below will then appear within this area. Next, change the mask feather setting to somewhere between 10 and 30. If there are any lighting and grain inconsistencies between both video clips, feathering your mask will help blend both videos, making the inconsistencies less noticeable. 